We'll soon know. Under a minute, they break out very fast and superpower on the extreme left. Paley Prince on the right. Career in the white sleeve jacket, uh, just a bit outpaced as almost blue comes through to take them on. The pace is very strong indeed, and they race down through the first furlong. And next to the rails, it's Superpower that shares a running with almost blue on the wide outside, and the red racing alone is Paley Prince. Then comes Access Travel Career outpaced. Uh, some two to three lengths behind them, Shuttlecock Corner, Hemi Hemi can't keep with them, neither can their lovely ears, that's tailed off, but they're past halfway already, and almost Blue has the position next to the rails, but Carrera is starting to make ground now, just over a furlong and a half to go, almost Blue gets a reminder next to the rails, but down the centre of the track is Shuttlecock Corner, the horse with a white face that's going on very well, racing down to the furlong marker, Carrera uh, coming there wide, but it's Shuttlecock Corner who has the advantage, Carrera tries to close under extreme pressure, Shuttlecock Corner's just holding on, Carrera starts to edge close home, but up towards the line, Shuttlecock Corner holds it. Shuttlecock Corner, the winner, Carrera is second, almost blew his third. Superpower finish for him, E5, and then a gap then to Paley Prince. Then came Access Travel, who disappointed. Uh, lovely ears was outpaced and outclassed around, but a bit of a result this for the bookmakers on St. Ledger Day, because this Group 2 race has gone the number seven, Shuttlecock Corner at the very generous 9-1. to one. This one owned by Mr. John David Abel, trained at Melton Mowbray by Paul Felgate, Paul's biggest winner so far, ridden by Ray Cockburn, who's riding horses with a tremendous amount of dash and elan, and at 9-1, to one, save the book is a packet, because this horse beat number five, Carrera, owned by Sheikh Mohammed, trained at Newmarket by Michael Stout, and ridden by Walter Swinburne, the third horse home, being the pacemaking almost blue.